Okay, what we're doing here today, HHO sports fans, is we're taking the hog generator. We call it a hog generator. This is our trademark here. We've had it since 2007. You'll find it on our website, LeBlanc Engineering. Uh, it's LeBlanc Engineering YouTube and www.leblancengineering.info. Anyhow, what we did here is we cranked this thing up, put the air compressor on it, pumped it up to about 70 pounds of air pressure in here, the leak checked it again. The weak link of this whole system, of course, is these uh, vinyl uh, tubes we use to, for grommets, so you need to invest in best material for this to keep this thing uh, from leaking. That's a uh, weak link here. Anyhow, what we did, we cranked that thing up to about 70 pounds. We put the uh, the regulator on it, and we're running right into the manifold right here with just air pressure. We wanted to see uh, if the fuel rail was leaking, if it was going to hold any pressure, so we know what to expect as far as the uh, leak rate goes. Anyhow, what we had to do was take off this uh, factory hose, fuel hose, that goes to the fuel injection rail. It's real pain in the neck take this thing off. you got to be careful you don't break it, pop this thing loose, push it up with some screwdrivers and stuff. Uh, Anyhow, it's really kind of hard to get off. Once you get it off, good to go. What we're going to do is put a, uh, a temporary fuel line in here with a fuel uh, with a meter on it. This gauge. In fact, we're going to put the same gauge on right over here and verify what this fuel pressure is when it's running on gasoline. I was told from the factory, uh, from the dealer, that it's 55 pounds of pressure fuel pressure at the fuel rail. So we're going to verify that. Uh, and then we're going to take this thing and we're going to fire this uh, bad boy up and put some HHO gas and see if we can get it to idle. We'll go from there. All right. Thanks for watching.